got me hitting the shit. Bad little bitch, she got ass just like Iggy, and she don't do it all for them hundreds and fifties. Do this for fun, we don't show them no pity. Don't try to run, you get hit just like Ricky. We got them drums, we ain't told no semis. Grab your cup, fill it up, then mix with the Henny. I heard that he flexing, I might have to do him bad. Empty dollars pockets, then I threw it in the Louis bag. What's poppin'? You already know who it is, but if you don't, my name is Mason. So where's Cam? Cam's not here. And she's gonna be gone for a while. Why? Her and mom are arguing. Dasha! She didn't say it last night when I saw her. People got TikToks of me. Uber upset right now because all these fucking clowns are acting like we're in a fucking circus. So for him, I feel bad. For me, I'm like, y'all got me looking at that better. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> This big ass bitch, Big Bird, with his sparkly ass, come out of nowhere with his fucking nail polish talking about, I'm talking shit. Of course I'm talking shit. You probably really see me on other reality shows. But you know, yeah. I'm like the hottest model so you gotta have. I just, you know, I just like strangers taking all the movies. So, oh, you know. okay. And Golf Productions greenlit me to do a spinoff called Hollywood Hustle. Of course, you already know where I'm from. So I'm about to put some people together that I know are true hustlers and we about to turn it up. You never know who might see this, man. This That's why we got to make sure that the stuff looks so good. Because, you know, we'll, we've been to drop the first episode and who might... You know, email me like, like, hey, we like that Hollywood hustle. They will. Hi, uh, my name is Leonte Ritz I'm a fashion model. Who also makes R&B music, or, you know, just spreading energy. That's me. Yeah, I like that, for real. Uh, that, that Hollywood hustle that we pushing. And June was cool with equals, man. You know, he, he came up and hung out with us um, during our first day. And we all just, you know, had a great conversation. He was spitting wisdom about the, you know, the business and what we were doing, but he was also sharing knowledge about like how how life goes, right? We were talking about a lot about how like you know you really gotta share your hustle. You, I always hear people say you never listen to what people say. You just go mm. for what you want to do. I like that. Like you got to. I see Will Smith said, um, what was that like two years ago? He said nobody can tell you how to do your dream because exactly. they haven't done it yet. Exactly. You know, you got to believe in yourself and just go. And that's why I tell people, you can be scared to take no risks. Hey guys, my name is Lex Styles. I am a stylist and editor-in-chief of Lex Styles Mag. When you have somebody that's already necessarily quote-unquote booming, mm -hmm. they got their whole little ratio of followers versus following. Yeah. That and third. But sometimes the content garbage. Mm. So sometimes you'll be like, all right, yeah, he got a good follow, and are we going to do this for ourselves versus the person who will have a subtle amount, like, I don't use this in social networking, but I'm really networking, I'm in the street. Right. So now if you really go look at his page, it's like, oh, it's a, people shouting him out, like, oh, he got this kind of post, this, this, that, and third, or she, your she, you know what I mean? Whatever, but like, see, really in the street for real. Yeah. So it's like, all right, I'm really out here networking how you are, so I came across somebody like, look, I don't, I don't do the Instagram, but... Bump elbow, boom, boom. So it's just like, damn, like, you know, I know a guy. Yeah, hey, if I don't got it, I. You feel me? Those yeah. for those kind Organic of networking. Really out here. Is, right. Organic exactly. networking is definitely like something that is like huge mm -hmm. in this industry. Too. Everybody was preaching and talking and trying to get this whatever out. I was ready to take a shoot. It was hot. I can't even take a picture with it. No, I feel you. Y'all ready to get to this photo shoot? Oh, well, let's get at you. You already know what we came here for. Let's get at this. Oh, yeah, I don't follow black you. Black on black on black. <laughs> Bruce Wayne. Everybody kept asking me in school, like, are you going back home? I'm like, yeah, I'm going back to LA where yeah. I can make me That's some money. That's how I am too. I'm from here. So I just met some more cast members. I met Mason, Frank, Dre, and Makai. And honestly, because you know, I don't really vibe with everyone. I'm really actually vibing with all of the cast members. I'm from oh. Southside Jamaica, so. Y'all crazy out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're we'll be uh, crazy out there. What's good, what's poppin'? My name is Frank Anthony. I'm a singer, songwriter. I know I ain't perfect. I know I ain't always right. All that good stuff. <laughs> yeah, but um, I'm not that crazy anymore. I came out here to work my career, so I've been doing the damn thing. Yeah, what's good? It's your boy Dre from Hollywood. I uh, do photography and a podcast. So I'm chilling with Frank, Dre, and Lex, and I'm catching their vibe. 
And I've been around Frank a couple times, you know, through like Zeus stuff, and then I also met Dre at a Zeus event. And Lex, I just met her, and she seems super chill, but she also seems like the type like, don't fuck with me. Oh shit. We are on Jamaica. That's where I used to do my ball head. I was ball back then, but. That you said that. Hey, what's up, little bit closer to the stage. I know it's hard to trust a, a white dude in a trench coat asking you to do this. <laughs> okay, so... I seen that they were talking about in a group chat that Leontay was going to perform, and uh, I wasn't going to let them know that I was going to pop up because that's exactly what I did. So please welcome to the stage the very talented Leonce! Yeah. 
and it's just I'm oh, sorry can you, can you cut the camera for a second I got I got I got hey this for the A girls, this for the Bay girls, this for the I don't give a fuck what he say girls Meet me at the Waffle how about Jordan State Betty yeah, by the late Bring a couple friends cause you stand late Ass on the dinner plate Eat it like my last like I had the A Slim thick Cause they put that shit on OnlyFans Send it to it, raise the price That's just like a plan nice Kick that nigga out, he can stay the night Daytime, catch a flight Back in ATL for the far vibes Bay girls for the city up For the one time And they got the Twin Cities hype now I am the bridge between these two cities Pipe down, I'm on the flight and this is zoo when I touch town, ass up, face down. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> hey, Cal, let that shit ride. See, I started off just doing this stuff myself, man. I started off freelance pretty much. Exactly. Like, all the content that I have and all that, I, I put myself through there. You know, I, um, I'm i an entrepreneur at heart, bro. I started exactly. a wedding event playing staffing business with my uh, mom in Sacramento when I was 13. I'm adopted. Right. So I got adopted at like a really young age. Then I started getting into acting more. Um, maybe in like third, fourth grade, started doing like little plays and stuff, wanted to do professionally. Um, but my parents, they work like high, intense, like major hours. Like major jobs and stuff yeah. to where like if they quit, like, like we, they we lose everything, basically. Um, and like I had a pretty good, I, I, like, I, I had a pretty good life. Oh, thank God. But, you know, that was like a sacrifice that they couldn't do for me, so I waited till I was 18. Back getting back into it, went into like red carpet and stuff. You know, right, right, right. Yeah. Finally got my management, uh, manager. management team. Yeah, I finally got my management team. Have a meeting with an agent tomorrow. Oh, nice. So Good luck with that, by the Thank way. Thank you. Appreciate yeah. it. Okay. I feel that uh, I got an agency meeting. That's or I got a couple of agency meetings on uh, Saturday and Sunday. So that's 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 working on those. That's gonna be that's the next big step. Is getting that representation. Yeah. Because that's when you start getting paid for your time. Make sure they represent you work. and not a brand that they want to push. Because right. it's a rela it's a relationship, honestly. Because you don't want to work with somebody like. That's not gonna put in as much effort and time as you're putting into your exactly. Because it's, it's your career. Like, exactly. Yeah. It's their career as well. It's their career because as well. Like, right. I really appreciate y'all pulling really? up today. You know, it's been a long day. You feel me? I'm a, you know, I'm a, I'm a ski out of the event. Kind of yeah. took a lot out of me for real, for real. I ain't gonna hold y'all. I honestly kind of feel the know, same, dude. I, I appreciate y'all pulling take up. I appreciate ways, the support. Honestly. You feel me? This is running right through me. I need to find the nearest bathroom and ASAP, Rocky.